I had just started a job on March, and I was there almost three months when I uh, suffered a heart attack. I had just gotten home from work, and um, I had chest pains. And uh, I told my husband that something is wrong, and my husband immediately said, let's go to the hospital. And they found out quite immediately that uh, I had four blockages on my heart. I needed immediate uh, surgery. I was uh, saved that night. Uh, I survived it. And after that, we had somebody come to see me at the hospital. She explained to us that I need follow-up care. I think he asked her how much something like that would cost. and. Um, I don't remember what it was, but it was something that, of course, we couldn't pay. I also received a phone call from my boss that I could not, um, that she had to lay me off. So I found myself without a job and, and also without insurance, both of them. I was without care for about six months. It's sad, you just feel sad, and, and, and uh, you just feel without hope. I knew that I needed care, but I didn't know what you know, what was out there for me. My husband got me out of the bed and said, uh, we're gonna go to see a doctor tomorrow. And I said, but what doctor? He said, we're just gonna go. I, I know of a clinic and uh, that uh, might be able to take you, so we're gonna start there. My first appointment was very significant to me and I remember it very distinctly because the, um, made me feel so welcome and like she really cares. She asked uh, what I went through and I told her and then she asked me about my medication as my husband told her and she said, uh, how much are you paying for those? She was alarmed because she said, there is no reason why you have to pay that much for your medication. She said, we can get this in here and you don't have to pay. In lieu of this one, we can give you this one. If you file these forms, you don't pay for this other one. I mean, she went through a whole list, and while she was doing that, and she was talking to my husband, I, tears were just flowing down my eyes. She said, why are you crying? And I said, the fact that you care so much for me enough to do this, uh, I've never experienced this before. People don't, don't do that anymore. It's amazing. It's a godsend. I am just so grateful. And I'm glad that um, uh, I found the care that I needed because who knows what would have happened otherwise. I mean, I want to be here because I have a daughter. I want to be around for her and for my husband and I have a lot more to live.